Hey guys, uh, we're here at Four Boys House Car Race Shop. Uh, we're here with Luke Eller. Luke's uh, responsibility is the back half of this car underneath. In a previous video, we saw Luke changing out an axle tube and a bell, uh, which is part of his responsibilities. So Luke, in the back of this car, what are some of the things that you guys have learned using the Montgomery Performance pull-down fixture? Well, definitely one of the first things that we learned was our driveline angle was off, and uh, we straightened that out and set it back down at tech height and uh, got our pinion angle so we know exactly where it needs to be at the tech height. And we got that stored away in our notebook. Very cool. What, what's something else you've learned in the back of this car using this pull-down fixture? Um, definitely uh, bar angles and locations. Uh, when to move them and what angle to have in depending on track condition and our wheel load numbers. Uh, anything else you learned back here? Um, definitely percentages, uh, rear percentage. Um, changing our uh, rear percentages on uh, changing our wheel load numbers. Moving your wheel loads around. Moving the wheel loads around uh -huh. our rear percentages. Okay. So Luke works on the back half of this race car, which is crucial because a lot of activity goes on back here. Uh, these are things you just can't see with your car on the racetrack. I tell guys, I don't know how fast you can run, but you can't run fast enough to run, chase this car around the track and see what's going on. But Luke has been able to learn a lot of the, the important intricate parts of this car using this performance pull-down rig. Uh, so that's, they're building their notebook up. So when they unload, they're fast right off the truck, and that's improved their performance. And we'll talk about some more things in the next video.